Britney Spears reveals in her bombshell new memoir that she previously had an abortion with ex Justin Timberlake because ultimately he didn't want to be a father at that time. In an exclusive excerpt via People magazine ahead of her memoir's release called The Woman in Me, Britney said, It was a surprise, but for me, it wasn't a tragedy. I love Justin so much. I always expected us to have a family together one day. This would just be much earlier than I'd anticipated. But Justin definitely wasn't happy about the pregnancy. He said we weren't ready to have a baby in our lives that we were way too young. She went on to say, I'm sure people will hate me for this, but I agreed not to have the baby. I don't know if that was the right decision. If it had been left up to me alone, I never would have done it. And yet Justin was so sure that he didn't want to be a father. They reportedly terminated the pregnancy in late 2000 when Britney was 18 or 19 years old. And Britney went on to say that to this day, it's still one of the most agonizing experiences she's had in her life. TMZ had some additional information via their sources and they said that Britney felt Justin was the love of her life when they were together and that she was raised to not get an abortion. Part of it was religious and part of it was what she's learned from her family. According to the book, Britney says she was conflicted but after some difficult emotional discussions, they both agreed getting an abortion was the right decision. Ahead of the book's release, which comes out on October 24, sources have revealed to page six that Justin Timberlake is allegedly concerned about what Britney is going to reveal about him in their relationship in her memoir. They said it's eating at him, while another insider said the tell-all was not a takedown of anyone in particular, which makes absolute sense. It's about Britney Spears' life, not about Justin Timberlake or any specific person. They said there was going to be bombshells, and from what we've seen today, it seems like that will definitely be the case when the book is released on October 24th, so make sure you're following for all the updates.